Yo guys, what's going on? Welcome back to Mutiny. In today's video, I've got another epic rat holes and sort of hidden base spots video on Crystal Isles. This spot is full of amazing rat holes and a lot of people don't know about some of them. A few on this video I've not actually seen in videos, which I'm really excited to show you guys. I just wanted to quickly say I've started a new Discord for the channel and I'm looking for some admins to run that, that sort of thing. If you guys are interested, I will leave a link below. So let's jump into the video. The first rat hole is at these cords here, and this is a really underrated base spot. If built right, I do get it could be easily PT span and that sort of a thing, but if you set it up properly, you can. I've built here before, and it's a really nice spot to pillar or cliff plat, you know, definitely early into why people put cliff plats here. I've had a full tribe here but the only problem was breeding but what we actually did was we cliff plat this whole area and turned it into a nice open roof base and it was a very good base spot. You know I definitely recommend this rat hole just for keeping your cryos. We had our farming stuff obviously on unofficial because the obstruction on here would be crazy on an unofficial server. So yeah guys definitely check this base spot out. So guys the next rat hole is at these cords here. And I really like this base but I've not actually seen it on another video, don't get me wrong, someone may have done one. But what you want to do is come over to this little corner over here, on this tiny gap here, and you've got a nice little opening to place your indie forges. And a lot of people say you couldn't build a lot in here, but I've personally built on here on unofficial, and I had a vault, like vaults all here, my cryo fridge is here, and I fit an indie forge over here. Obviously on unofficial, this would it'd still be a pretty good spot on on unofficial, but it would be much harder to build due to obstruction. But if it was me building here as well, and I had a big tribe, I'd use all this area here as like a breeding area as well. I'd maybe tear it off. It's a nice little base spot, so definitely check it out. So guys, the next rat hole sort of slash cave is at this cords here and this is an amazing spot like for a, especially for a half decent tribe you know a big tribe there's a lot of room in here and I've used it before I've built it here before and you can throw giggers out and stuff up top if you get the right angle it's a really nice base spot it's currently what my tribe are built in at the minute on my server I really like this spot especially in here for hiding your lot it's a little crouch spot there so you can even build a mini death wall and put your cryos here sort of thing so I love this spot and I really think you guys should check it out if you're looking for a good base spot for you and your tribe. Let's go on to the next base spot. So guys, the next spot is just a really nice hidden base spot and I've used it on solo before and I didn't actually get raided in this spot. It, the only problem was it was quite small and but I did manage to fit everything in here, you know, I had my little breeding bit for my PTs over here. It is a lovely little ledge, I, I definitely recommend it, and if you set up turrets right, it's really difficult to get in. Like, it, it is possible, definitely, if you've not got the correct setup, but I like this spot very much, and I definitely recommend it if you're just looking for a nice little solo spot, or, you know, a duos or whatever, you're just trying to hide some loot. So, let's go on to the next base spot. This is going to be the last spot on today's video, but don't worry, I will be making a new part to this, and I will be showing you how to build these spots in a new and upcoming video, but this is the last spot here, it's a really nice spot yet again, just a bit like the other spot that I showed you, it's good for a solo play, you know, high new loot, and if you set up, it's even like, just like if the server's just wiped and you need to get set up, this is one of them spots, you know, the sort of things you'd see Kishko building, and that toy per player, his play style, it's a very nice base spot, and yeah, I definitely recommend it in a lot of people don't know about these spots just because they're so hidden and that type of thing but definitely I'll, I'll show you a video on how to set them up but yeah guys definitely check it out however guys that is where I'm going to be ending today's episode I hope you did find some of these spots you saw and I hope you haven't seen any of these before because that's my goal you know I spend a lot of hours in solo player trying to find these spots and you know doing my research so I really hope you guys enjoy them. If you did, please smash the like button, hit the subscribe button. That would mean a lot to me. And I'll see you in the next one, guys. Peace.